geniuses, psychics, superstar athletes, masters of the martial arts, what is it that they all have in common? On the surface, it might seem ridiculous to compare a brilliant pianist with, a, with an unstoppable running back. But they have one significant thing in common. They are extraordinary. Why? Where does their gift come from? Is it possible that they are able to tap some sort of force which is generally unavailable to the average person? あの、<笑><笑><笑> おお。すごい。これ。大丈夫。いいですか、こんなこと言っちゃって。<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> I first met him in the early 80s in a Chinatown of urban Java. He didn't want his real name or address revealed, so we called him DJ for Dynamo Jack. He was only a healer, he said, but he did direct a powerful energy generated from his own body into his patients. Sometimes he used the needles, sometimes just his hands. He called the energy Qi, and it was so strong that he usually needed a grounder to hold his patient's feet. For years, we followed him around Java on his healing rounds, pleading to be allowed to film him, but he always refused, saying his powers resulted from a type of meditation with an ancient tradition of secrecy.
I'm not a person who um, can get deeply involved with meditation. Some mediums do. I don't find that easy. Um, but I like to pray to God and I ask the spirit world um, if there's anything I can do for them and tell them what I'm doing really and why I'm doing it. What's the reason for me demonstrating? What's the reason for me giving a private setting? I think it's to bring a little bit of heaven into two worlds. I came into spiritualism 24 years ago um, through illness. I'd had a hysterectomy and uh, I really just didn't get any better. I ended up um, with a um, tuberculosis of my kidney and uh, I'd gone down to about six and a half stone and things were going ra radically wrong and they thought really that I hadn't got very long to live. And uh, one day I'm sat at home and all of a sudden out of the blue I saw a man as clearly as I'm looking at you, I could see this man, and he told me to go and find a healer, or I wouldn't hear the New Year bells. I mean, I'd been arguing with God and saying why had he created all this for me, and um, I hadn't been a bad person, and, and, and why. Um, when Terry came home, of course, I thought, well, he's going to think now that I've gone absolutely crazy. And he came in, and um, I said to him, uh, Terry, you know, I've seen a man, and uh, he kind of just stared a little and I said, no, I haven't seen a man who was on earth. I've seen a man who's died and he's told me to find a spiritualist healer. And of course all the medication I thought was sending a, a bit do lally or round the twist, you know. So I could, uh, I could relate to that and, uh, and think, well, you know, um, when she saw the spirit world for the first time, I thought, well, perhaps it is the drugs, you know. You really don't know what to believe. And of course, I, I knew nothing about spiritualism or anything like that at the beginning. The wisdom. When I'm working in a church, I feel as if I'm free. I'm free from the limitations and I am with the spirit world. And when you have someone in the audience who says, Yes, that's my mother, and um, will you tell her that I love her, and things of that nature, it's, it's just like being in heaven, really. It's just like being in heaven. Thank She's met much. up with her sister, by the way. Yes, so yes. you've lost an aunt as well. Yes, yes. And the aunt must have gone quite quickly. Yes. Because your mum's grumbling again and saying to me, well, it took me longer to go, yes, you know. Yes. It took me longer to go than my sister. She went quickly. Yes. Uh, but she's lovely with it, and you must have adored your mother. Yes, I did. Because I get a wonderful link with her. Yes. Um, I believe your wife's on the earth, is that she, correct? That's correct, yes. Um, I'm glad I'm right about <laughs> that. <laughs> I'd have been in a bit of bother, wouldn't I, if I'd have been wrong. Uh, it's the way when I'm looking at the world of the spirit, I see them as, I'm, um, as if I'm looking at you. Um, when I hear them, I can hear a voice, and I know whether they come from Scotland or the south of England. Um, actually, it's a change of consciousness. We just alter our state of consciousness. And we're not seeing through these eyes, and neither do we hear through these ears. It is as if a faculty um, that connects to us just opens up, and as if we draw a veil or a spring comes back, and there we have the vision. Can I tell you that there's a Nelly here in the spirit yeah, world? Yes. Yeah. And if I talk to you about a Robert who was known as Bob, can you place me that, please? I just can't place that. Now, if you can remember. find Tom... Oh, yes, I know Tom. You can yeah. find Tom. Yeah. Now, Tom's not very tall. He hasn't got a collar on his shirt. He's open neck. And um, I feel that if you can find the one, then you'll eventually link to yes. the other. Norman wishes to be remembered, yes, so you Norman. know Norman. Yes. You also know a gentleman who would have had sugar diabetes, because I get sugar diabetes here, and the way you might recognize him was that he did have an operation, and I'm quite sure he must have lost a leg. Does that make sense to you? Uh, no. It doesn't? I'm, no, I can't. I can't really. talk about Arthur. I know Arthur. And if I can talk about... Oh, he lost a toe. Did he? Wait, well, uh, he did have I'm sorry, by <laughs> Yes, I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't think the specialist would be very pleased with me at all to a leg. But he just talked about, you know, <laughs> tell her, because the way she'll remember me is that, you yeah. know. And um, I just felt that the sugar did take him to the spirit world. Yeah. All right, darling. Yes, thank you. Thank you very thank much. You. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the world of the spirit, May I thank you for being here. You are the evidence that love, 
like life can never die. You have proved it. You have given. I pray that you all have received. Good night. God bless. Safe journey. Good life.